Greetings, LCR. We have over my shoulder here the Magi, and I also have these river rocks. You may remember pre-pandemic we did an art night where we were using these for a project, and last night we brought them out again for our youth. We had about 25 youth, K through 8, who were here for our program, and so uh, that is building momentum and energy. And we had the older kids write their name and a cross, and they gave that to the younger kids, and they said, say a prayer for the person whose name is on this rock, and then next week the young kids will share with the older kids, and we're trying to get them to pray together. Well, the reason I bring that up is we need to figure out who it is that we're going to call for our next leader of the youth. So this Sunday, after the second service, we're having an open forum. There will be food, so if you're planning on coming, it would be helpful to know. And we just want to start talking, what is it that we need at LCR in our next youth leader? I'll share some of my thoughts, you'll share some of your thoughts. And the concrete result of this is we will put together a committee that will be in charge of helping us find that next person, working with myself and the staff, maybe even the bishop, to help bring God's next candidate to LCR. Now, I wanted to remind you on October 1st, that's just coming up, we're doing a pet blessing that morning. We're going to have Lynn Ichiyama here with a rescue German Shepherd that could be adopted. So if you or your family has thought about adopting a pet, that would be a great time to come. If you have a pet that you would like a prayer for or a blessing, a dog, a cat, a Komodo dragon, you can bring it that day and Pastor Kim and I will both be here to say those blessings. And that's sort of in the spirit of St. Francis, which happens in October. And that will be our pet blessing. It's also the weekend of the air show, so you can get your pet blessed while well, all the jet noise, or maybe a protection from all the jet noise. And we're going to have uh, animal treats, and hopefully you'll stay and kind of run around on the lawn. And it's going to be a great time for us to pray for all of God's creatures. So lots of good things happening here. Thank you for your partnership in the gospel, and look forward to seeing you this Sunday.